Hi everyone. How's everybody doing today? I hope we're doing well. All right, I'm going to try the first uh, load test on this 11200. I uh, casted me a bunch of these things here. And uh, I just weigh them and marked on them. And uh, all I did, well, you can see the design on that. This is just one of those frozen meal things. <laughs> yeah, I just made a bunch of those so it would give me a bunch of weight because counterweights get a little teetery when you get a big stack of them. So I thought I'd make these things and it would help a little bit. And what made me think of it was that. I kept thinking, well, what can I make to make more weight? So we're going to try it with these. I've got some counterweights there to make up the difference if I once it gets real close. These things weigh anywhere from a pound up to just about two or a little over two pounds. <clears throat> Them things there were a firehouse subs container. That's what they put the sub in. So I just casted a couple of big things in there. And we got a couple of lever guys watching the load test there. So we should be in good shape. Put this back up here. I can't find my little bitty tripod, so we're going to have to do it with what we got. All right, we'll just start adding these until we go. Comes almost two pounds, one pound fourteen. Look how much it's moving that already. And this is pretty tight. I don't know if you can see the body from here, but yeah, it's I did a little little test and well, it really does it really does move that thing. Two pounds, six ounces. Yeah, it's almost on the ground. Took all that up already. Yeah, it's, it's pulling it now. It just pulled this uh, this guy arm back. We're not quite on the ground yet. Just about though. <laughs> it's it's kind of it's kind of resting on it. Yeah, it's it's stressing this thing pretty good. You can see that. Yeah, maybe you can. I would say not too much more. It's it's really it's pushed on the ground already. I can see it pulling it back up a little bit. I'm gonna say maybe we can do another pound. So we'll just add these up real quick. We got a pound there. Pound eight, so we got two point two pounds eight ounce. Uh, four pounds sixteen. That makes five pounds. Uh, this will make seven pounds six ounces. Seven pounds six. Let's see, eight pounds. Uh, Ten 
10 pounds. Eleven pounds fourteen ounces. Boy, look how look how far that took that down. And another one pound fourteen. And I lost track of how many we had. <laughs> I'll have to I'll have to add them back up and write it down. I'll, I'll do that real quick. Start all over. Sorry about that. I lose track too easy. Over three pounds on this side. A little over 12 pounds, and it could take a little bit more. It just started stressing it out a little bit, so I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it there. I did lower the boom, so it's only uh, one boom extended, and I've got the jib about all the way up. I'll get you a quick shot. You can see it's pulled way back. Uh, I did let it down a little bit so it's away from the crane. So it could lift a little bit more. But I'm not going to put any more weight on it. You can see after I took that off how that... Look how much tension it took off of that. So I'm going to move next. I've got the... 1750 set up so that'll be the next one i'm gonna move everything over there and uh tomorrow we'll we'll see how much that big bad boy can hold up and uh i may run out of weight over here because that thing is really solid so we'll see how it goes I'll get a better system for adding this stuff up real quick, like for you guys. In the meantime, I got to put this back into the shape it used to be. <laughs> it was kind of a hassle. I definitely had a little failure, but all is good. All right, y'all. There's the first one. Uh, 1750s coming up. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. The Libra guys say everything's good, so we're good to go. Have a great day, y'all.